Hi everyone, this is a tutorial for the Black Elephant Advent Shawl. Um, I want to show you how loosely you need to work the diagonal I-cord edge of each of the wings. So here I'm working wing one and um, this is how loose my I-cord stitches are on the diagonal edge of that wing and they really do need to be that loose. Um, it's so that there's enough give on that edge to stretch um, along that diagonal edge of the shawl. So here I've worked to the last five stitches. I'm just going to show you how I work those last five stitches to make sure that they stay as loose as this. So you work yarn over twice and then you work your knit three together. and then knit the last two stitches of the I-cord. Then turn to the wrong side. You slip the first three stitches with the yarn in front and you drop the yarn overs. So slip my first three stitches, let those two yarn overs drop from the needle as well. And you see how much slack you've now got on those three stitches. Keep that slack, okay? Resist the urge to pull on your working yarn because you will tighten them up by mistake. So here I'm working a garter stitch section. So I'm just bringing my yarn to the back. I'm holding onto these stitches, not pulling on this, this working yarn at all because you really want to keep the stitches as loose as they are right now. I'm gonna work the first knit stitch and keep it as loose as that and then carry on working as normal so you haven't pulled on your working yarn at all when you're working that first stitch you haven't pulled on any of the slack on those first three stitches of the wrong side because you do need um, that much give in your I-cord edge on the diagonal edge okay I hope that helps